Hi, it's Ken again. Um, let's see, we're coming now to the end of the Winter Wonderland event, so I thought I would do a, just a really quick video. Um, what to do to clear out your inventory of all that stuff. I mean, for, um, you know, if you want to and you've got the space, obviously you can keep everything that you've got, um, but uh, it'll, I mean, it'll still be good next year. However, um, I tend to be quite full of my inventory, so I just want to get rid of all, all. And, um, yeah, I don't really want to see it until next year. And quite frankly, I pretty much bought everything I wanted just from grinding through various things this year. So I don't think I really need to keep any of it. Anyway, there are sort of three different types of, uh, material stuff that you'll get, um, from various things around the Winter Wonderland. Um, the basic ones are all these uh, holiday ornaments. You're like, uh, what's that? Targ fur earmuffs, Terran holiday ornaments, uh, those sorts of things. You get those as drops from uh, pretty much everything from the waves of Tide of Ice. Uh, you can get them from the Winter Invasion queue, etc. Anyway, every, everything drops them. They're good for buying things from the holiday item vendor. Um, uh, and that's pretty much it. Then the other types that you can get, you can get um, epos and epo tags, uh, and that's just from the fast and the flurious event, that little um, sort of PvP race that runs from the top of the hill. Uh, and then you can also get, of course, your autographed glossy pictures of Q. Um, those are the only ones I'm going to talk about. Um, these other guys over here, the gingerbread man and woman, um, etc. Um, you can also get a a uh, little snowman as well. Um, they're non-combat pets and unfortunately they're bound to character and there's not really anything you can do with them except just keep them or ditch them, sadly. So anyway, um, first of all, let's go and get rid of some of these ornaments. Where am I going? Ooh. Let's try and not run into people. Um, yeah, so mostly what you're going to do with them is trade them in for uh, gold press latinum, which you actually get quite a lot if you've amassed, um, I can't do the math very quickly, but um, I've got quite a lot of things here. If you go over to the GPL conversion unit, click, go into the store. So the GPL trade in basically for one Terran holiday ornament, you get 200 gold press latinum. Um, so you can go ahead and sell all of these that you want. It's a little bit of a pain because you can only do one at a time. So you kind of go buy, okay, buy, okay. Um, that's going to get really repetitive. However, you'll get an absolute ton of gold press latinum out of it, which is really great. Um, I don't know. Actually, let's go and have a look. I'm not sure if you can sell these on the exchange haven't actually looked yet. I'm not really sure why you'd want to. Check out the market. So. Oh, okay, yeah, you can sell them on the exchange if you want, although I suspect because they're just normal drops and actually the stuff in the um, uh, store isn't very expensive, I think you'd be lucky to get a thousand energy credits for it but that's just me but it, you know it could help um, convert those into energy credits instead of gold press latinum if that's what you're into. Right, the next one are the Epos and again they can get... Hang on. Okay, thank you Mr. Gingerbread Man. Thank you very much. All right, so the GPL conversion unit, again, go into the store. Uh, there's a winter Epo tags tab. Um, and basically, you trade in Epo tags and Epos for uh, marks of your choice, which is actually really handy, especially if you've taken the time to level something up to an elder. You get a, a box of 200 marks of your choice, uh, which, um, depending on where you are with your reputations, can be really, really helpful. I find them quite useful because I'm still sort of tier two with most of my reps um, and because there's still a few days left um, you can actually you still have time to do a few of these so let me just um, go in I forget which ones I have mm, nope a candy stripe so I've got a candy stripe epo pup and a moppet with earmuffs I'm gonna do him first just in case it locks me out of the other oh 
no available slots. When I do have some available slots, I'm going to do that uh, because the elders, which are these big guys here, um, are worth 200 uh, reputation marks, which is really very handy. Right, now the last one that I'm going to talk about is the autographed pictures of Q. Now, sadly, there's nothing you can do with them. You can't sell them on the exchange because they're bound to the character, not even your account, your character. So you can't even mail them to yourself um, uh, through the account bank. They are just um, for you and you alone. Um, you can discard them if you really hate them, but you, they do carry over till next year. Um, and I know quite a few people that after they've got their ship that they wanted, they just carried on getting their um, glossy photos because they carry on forward and then you can get a bit of a boost next year. Right, so that's it. Uh, I'm going to go and get myself some gold press latinum uh, and I'll see you next time. Bye!